guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here i'm tiffy or bish and basically from the title i'm pretty sure you've already read that i'm gonna be doing an autumn haul so basically i went shopping the other day and i popped into primark this is practically what this haul is it's practically a primark plus zara haul I only bought one item from Zara to be fair so whatever but yeah I literally went into Primark the other day after ages and literally I was shocked like I used to go to Primark like ages ago but then I stopped because I just felt like you'd wash your clothes and then after it's just gonna like it's just gonna die it's just gonna you know it's just not gonna be there anymore they're just gonna get tattered the colors gonna run something is going to happen so i stopped going into primark because obviously i felt like you know if you spend a little more obviously i'll get more value for money but yeah i literally went into primark that other day and i was shocked like i couldn't believe what i was seeing there was actually some really fashionable trendy pieces so I'm going to be trying them on for you today of what I got. Just like little bits and bobs just for autumn, you know, switch up the wardrobe a little bit. So let's get into it. So first item is from Zara. This is the jacket that I got from Zara. I love it. I think it's so nice. I love the colour. It's like this mustardy colour. It's suede and obviously the fur on the inside yes <laughs> so i've already worn it right and i won't lie to you i wore it on a night out and i did spill coke on it on the sleeve and to be fair i can't see it anymore that's actually crazy. I'm just saying Coke, but it wasn't actually just Coke. It was Coke and Desirano. So I thought that the alcohol might stain it. And obviously Coke is a dark colour. But literally, literally, it's not on here anymore. I'm so shocked. I'm like happy. I don't think you guys understand. So let me try. So this jacket was actually $25.99. Now, let me tell you, right, I love Zara, but Zara's one of them stores. It's like, I'm not going in there, to be fair. For me, anyway, I'm not going in there unless it's, like, after payday because I don't, I don't have the money. But I do know, hold on, let me, let me twist the camera. Oh, yes. Mm. It's really warm. I got it a bit bigger than I usually would. I've got it in a large just because if you lot don't know, then I live in England and England is cold. So I wanted to be able to like layer it up and stuff. I took a picture in this Zara coat and these jeans I'm about to try on for you guys. I've already worn them too. <laughs> You know when you get new clothes, anyone like me when you get new clothes and like the first time you go out is like you're piecing the pieces together, like you gotta wear them. So yeah, I got these jeans. I don't know if you can see but they've got ripped knees. These are my like first official ripped jeans because I bought ripped jeans from Bershka one time and they were too ripped. I looked like, I looked ratchet, let's just say that. So yeah, I got these high-waisted black jeans. I got them in a size 8. I've lost a lot of weight since I gave birth. But anyway, let me try these jeans on. So these are the jeans. I don't know if you can see them properly. Mm. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> these are the jeans. I like them. I like them a lot. Look, they give you that like dip illusion because i ain't got much booty but i like them a lot they're actually black as well i'm so sorry you can't even see the knee bit but yeah i like the rip i like the fit but yeah i like the fact that they're really high they cover my belly button and after having a baby i won't lie to you i got stretch marks around my belly button so i appreciate things that cover my belly button because I don't have my belly bar there and I just don't feel comfortable anymore but yeah 
those are the jeans they were 13 pounds the next thing i bought was a hoodie bought this hoodie i thought it was quite cute it feels so soft i'm not even lying to you i was so i was impressed by primark i still have the tag on this one it was 10 pounds i also bought these in a large just because as i told you like i want to be able to layer things on i don't want it to just fit me like i don't know i want it to I want to be able to put stuff under i want to be able to put stuff on top i think this will be really good as well when i go back to uni because you know sometimes you ain't got time to just be you know i ain't got time to be trying to do fashionista i just want to put on a bloody hoodie and keep it moving i'm about to put this on my hair i don't know how people do this my hair's getting messy <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. I actually haven't tried this on but I like it I like how baggy it is I think maybe I got it a little bit too baggy but I'm not mad because I like to be able to roll this up, like this little hem bit. I like rolling it up. Oh my God, guys, this is so soft. Plus, I feel like oversized is in. So, you know, when I'm doing my little boy pose, you know, it goes cute with the jeans. It looks a little... The only thing as well about these jeans, they pick up a lot of like... Them like hairs, fur. Like, you see this? like i don't know if you can tell but it has little like hair things when these come off they go onto these jeans mm, i hate that but whatever it's not that bad but next i got this mustard i don't even know what it is swell is it a swell it's long at the back. I love this colour. I think I'm obsessed with mustard. I really like the colour. I think it looks nice on black girls. You know what I mean? So, yeah. This was £8. This is it on. Yeah, you see, I like the way this slants. Like, it gets longer in the back, I think. It's quite cute. I like that. Like, my little mosquito bites coming through side but i like it it fits my long arms which is good i like the round neckline i think that's quite cute as well i got these ripped jeans i tried to wear them but i didn't actually go out in them so i still got everything on them but yeah i got a size six because uh, they're not high-waisted so you know i wanted it to fit decent so i got a size six because that's what i am at the moment they're 15 pounds ripped jeans let's try them on okay so these are these jeans they stop at my waist i wouldn't say they're given the best illusion of my booty i like when a jean cups like here because then it's like okay that's where your booty stops it's not like a straight into my leg there's nothing really there but the rips quite cute looks quite nice with this top as well yeah i prefer the black jeans over these jeans i guess they're 15 even though it's like two pounds difference it's like why those ones fit a lot nicer like i like the stretch of them these ones aren't really stretchy i also got this brown hoodie this was eight pounds got it in a size 10 i would prefer it to be a bit more oversized because look let me show you with this underneath it even though i don't think i'd wear a jumper underneath a hoodie but i don't think i can even oh maybe i can but it's tight do you know what i mean look see what i mean you can already see this effort going into it i don't, I don't want it to have like 
no see like if i'm going somewhere quickly and i'm just throwing something on i don't want there to be effort thinking oh my god i'm gonna mess up my hair i'm gonna mess up my face because because i'm trying to get it on so obviously i got it too small for my liking i'm surprised i can wear the jumper underneath it so far so that's not that bad but you see what i mean all this effort for what this is the jumper i like the fact that it's brown you know i think it's a nice full color i think brown goes well as well with me looking like one cup of coffee mm -mm -mm. cup of coffee ooh, ooh, ooh. I kind of wish I got it bigger, but I've already worn it and I've already taken the tag off it and it already smells of my perfume, so it can go back. It can. Ah! You see what I mean? It's too tight. In 2017, girls are wearing wigs out here. We can't afford to be trying to. You know, what if I was hot and I wanted to take it off? Now I have to worry about the safety of my wig. No. 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 Oh, uh, God. Sorry. My final jean of the outfit. I mean, jean of the video. These jeans. They're like ripped. They're not ripped, actually. They've got like small rips like a grey washed out jean and they've got these little scuffs at the bottom I like that the actual ankle swingers as well like they cut at the ankle ankle grazers I think that's the actual name size 8 10 pound they're 10 pound not bad that's fine I think that's okay these are low waist as well see I like this like little white light bit you can see and the last final bit i got was this denim jacket denim jacket i like this i love this actually i'm, I'm lying it's from prime again it was 25 pounds i told you it was like the zara one it's got the fur all on the inside don't need base that's base the only base the only base has not got fur is actual sleeves but it's got it on the end so i don't mind the sleeves not having fur i got this in a size 12 again going for that oversized look everybody's doing it nowadays <laughs> this is 25 pounds denim ripped long Isn't this so cute? Pockets. Oh, I love this. I think it just adds a little bit more of an edge, a chicness to your outfit. Now you can have it gully or you can have it cute. And I like that because some days I'm gully and some days I'm cute. So I love this. Look, it's like ripped. It's so edgy. I love it. No, I love it. This is from the Glamour as well collection i love the fact that it's got these mustard i don't know if you can see it but it's got these mustard like stitching around it on the end there's like this rose goldy corner of the buttons yes it's actually rose gold it's not actually like worn out because i've never done the buttons on this i love it i love it i think it's so cute so that's it this is all i got from primark so this concludes the end of my autumn haul leave a comment below to tell me what your favorite piece was what you would buy what you wouldn't buy girl you should return that girl yes yeah, slaying that again i have a picture in this jacket on my Instagram again it is Tiff your bish if you haven't already make sure you subscribe make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend make sure 
you like make sure you go watch another one make sure you come back for the next one also turn on your bell so you get notified when i drop a video i'm gonna try to stay consistent my mouth is foaming i can't even speak but yeah i'm gonna try to stay consistent thank you so much to all the new people that have subscribed to my channel even though i'm hardly posting as consistent as i wanted to i appreciate you i appreciate my old subscribers that keep coming back to watch what i'm doing i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you in my next one bye